increasingly in the news that top civil servants, but also top NHS officials, including Matt Hancock, including Dido Harding, including Sir Simon Stevens, were all involved in meetings uh, with, um, uh, with Greensill, uh, whose essential plan was to get hold of these huge um, it was to was to bankroll actually he had an advanced payment scheme so he would pay wages in advance on a daily or weekly basis in that way he uh, the NHS would owe him money he would uh, pile up this debt as a collateralized debt obligation float it on the stock exchange as a as a complex derivative um, a, a, of the kind which was associated previously with the uh, with the banking crisis of 2008 as that scheme has collapsed that has led to the whole challenging of a number of people who he bankrolled, uh, including, um, of course, the famous Indian billionaire uh, uh, Sanjeev Gupta, uh, who was the main bankroll of Liberty Steel and various other um, uh, industrial um, uh, uh, organizations and sectors, um, which will lead to mass redundancies in working class uh, communities across the North and the Midlands. Uh, including Hartlepool, where, of course, the current gen uh, general election uh, by-election will be taking place. And linked to that has been former uh, uh, Prime Minister David Cameron, but also the current Prime Minister Boris Johnson, and the whole management infrastructure um, of our NHS and government.